Tonight, the clock is ticking on when a new homeless encampment will be forced to move. As ABC 4's Nicole Newman reports, it comes as a donor offers to buy land for the camp as a permanent home. Camp Last Hope was set up less than two weeks ago. Today, it was given notice it has to tear down by next Wednesday. This afternoon, a group of men identifying themselves as employees of Union Pacific Railroad showed up at Camp Last Hope. The homeless encampment is located near 1276 South and 500 West in Salt Lake City. We're giving you till next Wednesday the 30th because you are on private property. So we're not going to put up with that. And that's exactly why we're going to stand firm here. They have nowhere to go. ABC4 first visited the camp on Friday. It's when we met Bless. She's one of four pregnant women living in the camp. We're trying to build a community where we don't have that, where we don't have people that are going to beat us or rape us or hurt us or do whatever. The men who showed up today identify themselves as special agents from Union Pacific, and they say that these tracks are still active. We are special agents for the railroad, okay? so this needs to be removed or the railroad's going to come in with their equipment and remove, remove everything. Thais Bellamy works directly with the unsheltered. They started walking through the campus, they started taking photos and everything, and they were like laughing. She says after Friday's report, a donor stepped up offering to raise money to buy land for the camp to permanently set up. We're working on getting them um, onto private property. ABC4 did reach out to the Salt Lake City Mayor's Office and Union Pacific for comment. We're still waiting to hear back. In Salt Lake City, Nicole Newman, ABC4 News.